the RSA chase is next. This is a three mile noise chase. And it's a grade one again. And at the top we've got our success for David Hooley, Discover Aegis, Darren Thompson, Moons of Jupiter, Craig Beckwith, Nomadic Bygraves, David Robertson, The Tiny Horse, Joshua Sutherland, Velvet Diamond, Graham Clutterbuck, Cleric's Cloak and Cleveland, both for Leon Van Rensburg, Double Chance, David Hooley and Firebrand for Joshua Sutherland. So 10 to face the starter in this ninth race of the festival. And away we go. Making their way towards the first of the fences. And all safely over the first. And this Discover Aegis used to settle down into the lead. There were 18 more to take in this Novices Gold Cup. And this Discover Aegis has gone on by a couple of lengths for Darren Thompson. Art of Success is in second. Firebrand on the inside is third. In comes Clarence Cloak and Nomadic Bygraves as they get to the second. A mistake at the back there by Cleveland. And prone to the on air on that one. That's our one or two of Leon's this season. But it's Discover Aegis who's got the lead and is too clear. Oh, Firebrand in second. Clarence Cloak is third. And then Art of Success as they get over to the third. Which they're all safely over. Cleveland just struggling a little bit at the back after that early mistake. Plenty of time to get back on an even keel and Discover Aegis is in the lead as they get to the water. Discover Aegis over at the in front by a couple to Clarence Cloak in second. Art of Success is third and Firebrand is fourth. Then comes a gap to Nomadic Bygrounds and Moons of Jupiter with the Tiny Horse double chance. Uh, then Velvet Diamond as they get to this ditch which they're all safely over. Cleveland the back marker has jumped up alongside Velvet Diamond there. It's about 15 lengths first to last at the moment Discover Aegis leads into the sixth. All again over nicely. Darren Thompson still looking for his first winner of the week. Oh, there's one or two that have run well. Clarence Cloak for Leon Van Rensburg already with two on the board. As they get to this ditch. All safely over the ditch. With Velvet Diamond now relegated to back spot. But Discover Aegis is in front. Clarence Cloak in second. Art of Success is third. Firebrand is fourth. Then Nomadic Bygraves and Moons of Jupiter. The tiny Halls after that one. Then Double Chance. Then Cleveland and finally Velvet Diamond. Over number eight they go. All safely over that again. Cleveland was untidy and down on his nose. He's going to have to get that jumping sorted out. He's going to play a part in the finish. Discover Aegis is taking them along at a decent enough pace. Leads by a good six lengths. To Art of Success in second. Firebrand is in third. The Tiny Horse is fourth, then Moons of Jupiter is next. Then Firebrand and Clarence Cloak as they begin the swing into the straight. And Discover Aegis went right through that one. Cleveland was slow again at the back. The lead. He's now down to two lengths as they get over the next one. He can jump that one much better, the leader. And got away from it. Well, that'll be the last on the next circuit. They're going to swing left handed now and go out for one more circuit of Presbury Park. And it's Discover Aegis who leads by three or four again to Firebrand, who's in second. Moons of Jupiter has gone third, and the Tiny Horse is fourth. Then Velvet Diamond is fifth, and then Double Chance and Nomadic Bygraves, and then Clarence Cloak after that one. And there's a faller there. It's Art of Success has gone. So David Hooley certainly knows the Art of Success today. After a good start, well, that's his first blip, really, as Art of Success crashes out. But Discover Aegis is in the lead and clear. Over this next one. All over that, OK. Uh, Clarence Cloak made the mistake this time, and the two Leon Van Rensburg horses are last now. But it's Discover Aegis who's still in front, despite a couple of mistakes as they race down towards the water jump. Got over that one, OK. Moons of Jupiter is second, Firebrand is third, Tiny Horse is fourth. Then comes Velvet Diamond and Nomadic Bygraves, and then Cleveland as they get over that ditch. All over that one nicely. Discover Age is still bowling along in front. From Firebrand second. Well, he's gone this time, the leader. He's gone. He got a bit close to that one. He rattled his hooves into it, and this time the jockey couldn't stay on the plate. And he's gone. 
So Discover Radius is out of it, and that's left Moods of Jupiter in front. Firebrand is in second. The Tiny Horse is in third, and Velvet Diamond is fourth. Then comes Nomadic Bygras. They get to this ditch, and over that one they go with Moods of Jupiter in the lead from Firebrand in second. Then comes the Tiny Horse, Velvet Diamond. Nomadic Bygras is after that one, then Double Chance, and then at the back, the Van Rensburg pair, Clerics Cloak and Cleveland, who suddenly find themselves no more than eight to ten lengths off the lead. It's Moons of Jupiter who's in that lead, leading by two lengths to Firebrand in second. The Tiny Horse is third. Velvet Diamond is now coming with a good looking one on the outside. Then Nomadic Bygrades being scrubbed along. Then comes Double Chance over the 17th. That's the third from home. And Moons of Jupiter is under pressure now from Velvet Diamond in second. Firebrand is third. Nomadic Bygrades is running on in fourth. Then Clarence Cloak, the Tiny Horse, suddenly in a bit of a flat spot. Then comes Cleveland. Double Chance is now the back marker. They've still got two more fences to take and it's Moons of Jupiter and Velvet Diamond an unlikely pair to be battling out the finish at the moment Moons of Jupiter and Velvet Diamond are in front from Cleric's Cloak Nomadic Bygrades and the Tiny Horse as they swing for home they've got two still to take and it's Moons of Jupiter who's going to land him a little bit didn't jump it well a better jump by, by Velvet Diamond and now Cleveland's going round the outside and so too is Cleric's Cloak over the final fence they go and it's Cleric's Cloak who lands in the lead but here comes Nomadic Bygrades it's Cleric's Cloak and Nomadic Bygrades are pulling away Cleric's Cloak by ahead Nomadic Bygrades on the near side Cleric's Cloak's in front Nomadic Bygrades is trying to get closer it's Cleric's Cloak and Nomadic Bygrades it's got to be on the nod Cleric's Cloak Nomadic Bygrades just getting up Nomadic Bygrades just I think it's close it's close and the angle is deceptive Nomadic Bygrades looked like he was just getting his head in front but Cleric's Cloak may well have hung on it's mighty close it's Nomadic Bygrades I think could be a dead heat this. It's a short head win for Nomadic Bygraves and David Robertson. So David Robertson always comes good at Cheltenham. And he lands a big one there with Nomadic Bygraves. A bit of a shock, I think. Clarence Cloak second for Leon Van Rensburg. The tiny horse for Joshua Sutherland third. Joshua Sutherland having a disaster of a day, really. And we're into race nine and he's not got anywhere near yet. Moves of Jupiter fourth for Craig Beckwith. Won a big race and Firebrand for Joshua Sutherland again was fifth.